everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Melanie and I do a lot of various types of videos including daily food hauls, weekly food hauls, beauty box unboxings, TK Maxx hauls, B&M hauls, watch unboxings, trainer unboxings, things like that. So if you like that kind of thing, please feel free to subscribe to my channel. Today's video is of a monthly subscription box called Pink Parcel. I used to be subscribed to Pink Parcel until maybe 18 months ago when the contents of it wasn't worth the money that I was paying for it so I stopped my subscription. I resubscribed in January and my box never arrived and it wasn't shipped but they took my money and I still don't know what's happened with that box so I finally got this month's pink box parcel today um Friday the 9th of February I think it's due around the 6th but there you go I haven't opened it yet I know it looks like it's been open but it, that's how it came out of the packaging and I think something's late because there is an orangey powder all over everything so if you're not aware pink parcels are monthly feminine hygiene parcel where you get all your essentials for your period and then there's also a box which is full of goodies and there's normally a tea bag and chocolate and then beauty items so I will show you everything that's in my box you can choose wh what you want if you want tampons or towels or one month you can have towels and then you can have tampons the following month or I believe you can now mix them up and have a few of each so without further ado let's get inside the box and there is there's orange powder everywhere so I'm presuming I'm going to find something very badly broken up in here so you get a little book these books used to be bigger um, so I guess that's changed and it's got all the products in there then there is an Hello Fresh discount card. If you look in the down box, there is a discount code for Hello Fresh. So, if you want to try Hello Fresh, please use my code. Then there is this leaflet for scented. So I'm guessing there's a scented products in here. I used to have that one, and I lost it, and I regretted losing it because that was really nice. So I'm guessing from this there's going to be one of them in here, which I'm happy about. Then, hey you, love pink parcel. We have a little sister, Betty, especially for girls filled with sweet treats, beauty goodies and other surprises. Betty Box is the perfect period pick-me-up. That looks cute. I'm not a teenager, but I may buy that. And there's 50% off if you want to try it. PP Betty 18 I may try that just so I can get the goodies. So inside as you can see there is three boxes and a bag so you get the For You which has got all the goodies in and lots of orange powder for night so it's your night time whatever product you've got and then for later and then in this little bag which they used to be much better than this I see they've not got improvement on them used to be jawstring which was better because these just come on done but this is for your bag which is a handy thing to have but to be honest it opens itself so in here are some panty liners different brand to what they normally give unless it's just because of what I've got in here so there's five of those which are always handy to carry and then there is six pads I think these are the Finity normal without wings which I've never tried before so I'm surprised that I picked those but I probably just want to try something different in the for night box there will be nighttime towels and by the looks of them they are always Unless the Finity ones, there might be Finity ones actually, which is always anyway, so and there's five of them, so if your period's longer than five nights, it's not going to be enough. 
there is that orange powder everywhere I've got a feeling I'm going to have to contact Pink Parcel or for whatever's broken as you can see there's orange stuff everywhere and I like how it's marked out so it says for now there and for night there and then there's the for later box which is should be enough to last you the month I don't know if it ever has lasted me enough time so as you can see there's a lot of pads in here and I'll try and count them if I can get them out so there's 10 pads in there then we come to the for you box and I'm going to move the big box out of the way I think this is going to get very messy because I feel like there is something in here that's broken I'm going to zoom right in Oh, straight away as you can see I don't know if you can see how much powder is everywhere it's kind of ruined everything in the box and I can smell the chocolate so the thing that has completely broken everywhere I don't know why they don't put these in bubble wrap it's all over my hand shimmer bronzer so I wouldn't want this as a bronzer because I don't know if it's focusing but it's orange it is very very orange um, I don't know what else to say about this because it's in the shade Splendor which is orange uh, and it's on everything I don't know if I'm even going to try and get this out because it's going everywhere that is absolutely rubbish it's like all over my hands now so the next item is this which is also covered in powder it's the double chocolate chip MLA highly scented wax melt I don't have a wax melter. This smells really nice. It doesn't smell like chocolate chip. I don't know what it smells like. It's kind of a caramelly chocolate scent. I've seen this brand and I almost bought something the other day, but I don't have a wax melter. So I don't even know if I want a wax melter to be honest, but there you go. The next item, as I said, centered glove therapy balm it's a really tiny one like that is very tiny travel friendly aroma therapy balm to help you stay centered wherever whenever stop inhale reset neck temples wrist apply to pulse points inhale deeply and reset your mind repeat your new ritual daily restoring lifestyle balance naturally love Rose Pacholi and Cedarwood, well I don't like anything rose scented so this is going to be interesting. Key benefits, promotes feelings of harmony, peace and love, comforting and calming. When to use, when you feel overwhelmed and in need of a hug or simply, or simply out of sorts, love helps to restore a sense of inner peace and balance. An elegant and grounding fragrance to relax and unwind with any, at any time, 100% natural. Um, it's very very tiny like the full size one would have been better it would be better if everything wasn't covered in some orange powder so you twist it up as you can see and it is very well scented which doesn't doesn't appeal to me that at all sorry <laughs> the green one is nice I wish I still had it so that's that the next item that's covered in orange powder is Yu Yo Escape the Ordinary Verba Zing Organic with grapefruit and rose hip. I've got one of these somewhere from something else. I do like my teas, so I will try that. Then I'm pretty sure when I used to be subscribed to the box, we had a daisy, a dozy, and dam chocolate bar this is dark chocolate I don't like dark chocolate but I will try it this is all I can smell at the moment it's maple toasted rice and pink salt I like the packaging a lot but I'm not a dark chocolate fan and um, the next item I as you can see it's absolutely covered in orange powder if you would have watched my glossy box unboxing you will see that I got this exact primer so I've tried it a couple of times I'm not sure if I like it 
that it's cruelty free and vegan. So what you don't notice, and I don't know if you can see, but it's only filled up to there. I don't know if it's showing on the light at all, but this product is something like £20 and it's filled up to there. So I think it's the biggest waste of money, if I'm being really honest. And the final item, which is also covered in orange powder, I'm not impressed, pink parcel, is the Manuka Honey Hydrating and Moisturising Moisturising Korean Face Mask made with extracts of Manuka Honey to nourish your skin. I'm pretty sure I've had a face mask by this brand. It's a paper mask. I'm not the biggest paper mask or yeah I'm not the biggest mask fan the paper mask type I prefer ones that you just actually good old fashioned one you put on your face I think I've tried a cranberry one or something similar by this range and it was okay so that is everything in the box I am very unimpressed especially as one of the products which It says here, I mean, it looks better in the picture, but it does say it costs £13. I don't know how. I mean, it's also saying this is £28, but I'm pretty sure in the glossy box it said it was £22. So I think they make up prices to suit themselves. I'm very disappointed with the contents of this box because A, everything's smashed all over the place and the quality of the products are rubbish like this as I said it's up to there like I can see it because of the light I don't know if you are able to see it as well everything's covered in orange stuff and we've got a wax melt <clears throat> they're presuming everyone has a wax melter and we don't and that does not smell like chocolate chip I'm sorry Emily Victoria candles but it, it doesn't smell good very disappointed at this and by the looks of it it was totally orange and it wasn't orange and pink like the picture shows and who wants to put on an orange bronzer like I'm pretty sure most people try and avoid having an orange tan I know I do and I know I'm going to have to clean this mess up. This was not pink at all. It was just orange. And it is really disgusting. It's a really soft product. Like, that would blend really well. But, as you can see, it's the most orange product on the planet. If you use this, you'll probably look like an umpa lumper. So... I don't know if I'm going to stay subscribed to this box because as I said January's box didn't turn up, they charged me for it, it's still saying that it's been packed and it's not been sent so I don't know what's gone on there and then I received this and the products are rubbish and one of the products which they reckon costs £13 has broken and is all over the box so this is possibly the first and last video from Pink Parcel that you're going to see for this year from me but please let me know if you've got pink parcel what you think of pink parcel if your product shimmer bronzer or your umpa lumpa bronzer broke let me know what you think and any questions as always please leave them down below thank you for watching everyone bye